every game from now on to the end is going to be very important because we know each game is somewhat of a cup final, both for, for us and, you know, respectfully for Rangers. So it's very close and I think Sunday's game is going to be probably quite a close battle as well. So, um, yeah, everything's important. So we'll find out the team on Sunday, but how key would it be if your captain's back playing Cal McGregor? Always helps, yeah. Um, I think, you know, just having Cal in the change room especially will help massively, you know, just being the leading by example. You know, he speaks really well in the change room before games as well, which I think is really important. Um, and yeah, it'd be a massive boost if he's there. How would you assess your own season so far? Pretty eventful, like every other season is, you know. I think I've, I've learned a lot. It's probably the most I've learned in the season, just purely because I'm playing 90 minutes quite regularly, which I'm fortunate to say. Um, mentally, I think I'm probably in the best space I've been, um, which I think is probably translated onto the pitch as well. Um, no secrets there, just being honest. Like I think all the work I've done away from the pitch in terms of my meditation, my speaking with my coaches and stuff like that has really kind of just gone to the next level now. Um, and naturally, I've obviously probably improved a little bit as a player as well. I'm, I'm more experienced now as well, so that always helps. But I don't think I'm ridiculously different from previous seasons. I'm probably just getting a little bit luckier as well in front of goal. You said your season's been eventful. You signed a new contract, but there was also that bid from Atletico Madrid. How, was that distracting in any way, or is that maybe more motivational in, in um, some sense? Yeah, for being honest, like the first two, three games after the transfer window, um, mentally that was a slight challenge just because I felt somewhat of a more, you know, added pressure on my shoulders just slightly. Um, but then I realised, like, I didn't really know why I was putting extra pressure on myself. I didn't really need to change anything. Um, so then when I kind of just came away from that and just focused on, you know, what I bring to the team, it's kind of clicked back into place again. Um, that's why I mean being eventful this each season, regardless if it's going well, it will still pose a different challenge, you know. Of course, like, bids are great and stuff like that, but it can still potentially be a negative thing if you don't see it from the right way as well. So another thing to learn going forwards, yeah. How much has being an international footballer helped develop you as well this season? Yeah, that's been really good. That's what I mean, like, that's another experience. Um, you know, of course, like, with different language of player as well, so it's completely different tactics, completely different style of play. So, playing with players from really good teams as well, which has been something I really enjoyed. And you know, of course, I'd like to go to the Euros in the summer. We'll see what happens.